Kiki Wyatt addresses pregnancy rumors. Like, per like personally. Yeah. I want to know where you. So, personally. first of all, I done had 865,400 children. That's your business. You know, and I'm up here getting. Girl, be quiet. I thank God that I got the little belly that, that I do have after all these children um, that I chose to have. I ain't getting no stimulus check. I ain't getting none of that. So everybody that keep talking all this stimulus check mess, I don't live off the government, baby. I live off the Holy Ghost, my work, and my husband. We don't need the government's money. Hmm. Yeah. So therefore, all the ignorant comments, if you spit it out your mouth, I want to help you cram it up your... How about mind your bi... Oh, no. You know what? Don't mind your business because I am your business. Ooh. Because... I must be relevant to be all in your mouth. And this includes radio hosts that don't, you ain't got it from the horse's mouth. Call me. Move bean before I knock you out. Call me and ask me. Don't be volunteering information you don't know nothing about. That's what gets on my nerves with people. That's what makes me irritated. That's what makes me want to just freaking throw up in my mouth and then swallow it. I'm sick and I'm tired of people having stuff to say and don't know what the heck they talking about. Like, hey, like know all your facts. You're right. Honey, you don't need no facts. Right. Over in this house, I do. And I got all of them. And I don't need you doing nothing. And yes, I may be a little overweight. But I'm loving my overweight because I'm happy. And if you know anything about being happy. And most of y'all talking about it look like garbage. <laughs> garbage pail garbage pe garbage kids. Like, look at them acting like they want to be a family with my baby. I don't think oh, so. Y'all better not think about no baby. But I want to be a TT. A TT. I want to have a little niece and nephew. Girl, you got, they got 10 more years for all that. Anyway, like I was saying, I'm just tired of, um, thank you for having me in your mouth. Thank you for um, giving me all this energy. Give Thanks for energy. allowing me to um, pay rent in your head. Um, really being. But, uh, yeah, no, not pregnant here, ain't interested in being pregnant. And if I do, guess what? You're it's, paying it's my for business. It. Shut up. It's my bit, Mimi, I don't need no help, sugar line. Yeah. Anyways, look, just if people would just mind their business a little more. And what I think is funny is people talking about congratulations. All the people that know me know that I would just say something. And first of all, that stupid dress that I had on, on stage, because I know that's what y'all referring to, is called the boning on a corset. I sat down in the car, well, car service. I sat down in there for about an hour to get to my show, and my boning in the corset got bent. And ladies, if you know what I'm talking about, say howdy doody and hello. Because in real life, that happens. And when it bends, then it makes the stomach look bigger than what it is. It was in the dress. And no, I'm not pregnant. I don't want to be pregnant. And when I do, 
I will let you know because it'll probably happen again because I'm grown. I do what I want to do. My husband loves me. I love him. We don't care. We can pay for our children. We can feed them with no troubles because first of all, like I said, we got the Holy Ghost. We ain't living on no welfare. We ain't living in no, you know, no hate to whoever he is. That's your business. That's your life. That's your style. But that ain't our style. We don't live off of that. See what I'm saying? So, when I am pregnant, I'll let you know like I did all the other times. And what's funny is I don't even have to tell nobody nothing. But especially the haters, but my fans, I like to tell my fans because I feel like my fans are really my friends. Fans are friends to me. And because I feel that way, I'm going to tell my friends if I'm having a baby or not because they're going to be happy for me. They're not going to say that my you know what is so big, my husband got to put his whole body in there and I'll, no honey. Tidy schmighty, don't go there. Mama smighty. Don't do that. Don't do that. The baby comes out in a few seconds and when they when they come out, muscles go back. So don't go there. Only a hoochie mama might be stretched out and sloppy and floppy. No, honey. Not a mother that's had a lot of children. Only a hoochie will have those problems. That's what you call a tea hot. As, as my daughter says, a tea hot. I call them a thot. She says tea hot because they can't say thot at school. But all I'm saying is, let's know our facts, people. Let's know the facts. Okay? So, uh, yeah, God bless all the dummies out there. Because the Bible does say that God protects dummies, which are fools, chill babies and fools. And dummies, dumb dummies. So I pray that you are okay because you're dumb or fool and God will protect you because you don't know how to protect yourself. So with that being said, how's everyone doing? Is everyone having a nice night? I hate y'all. What the Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We're on our fanny. Anyway, so... Now that I got that out of the way, I feel so much better because first of all, I'm unbothered by people and they comment, but y'all just not, keep it coming. Girl, shut up. Y'all just keep them coming and then I'm just like, you know what, well, let me help these people understand, no, there's no baby in there. But baby, do we want another baby at some point? Huh? Because we can take care of them, right? And we can love them properly. And this is not a toxic household, not a toxic relationship. This is a godly relationship with love and honor. Right. right. So, if we decide to have a child, we'll, we'll let them know, babe. We'll let you know. We, we, you know. Mom, mama's just a little, mama's just a little thick. Give me my thickness. Let me have, let me, let, let me, let me sit into my not quite snapback yet. I mean, for as many kids as I had, I feel like I'm, 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 all right. I'm okay. My husband loves every, every dimple, every crevice, every crater. Honey, my body look like the moon. The same color, got the dimples, all that. The bigness, the roundness. He loves it. And so if he loves it, why am I going to change what he likes? But it don't mean I'm pregnant just because a stupid dress. Honey, y'all going to make me do a whole photo shoot on y'all and shut y'all's mouths. And it won't be etched and sketched and drawn in and schmalled in and bald in. Mm-mm. I'll just give you the trueness and the realness of what you see. I mean, you can't make live fake. I mean, live, you it's saw. Not possible. You I'm, really I'm, I'm not home. pregnant. I don't even. 
But it's crazy because I don't even got no stomach. You Not don't. for real. I mean, it's bigger than what it usually is. I'm gonna got a pooch, but. Had a baby, not even and and I don't lay on nobody's medical bed and get nothing sucked out and tucked in and first of all, you don't even in. like being put to sleep. No, that's just not no. Like you so afraid of them to sleep. I just wish people would mind their business sometimes. But wait, mama, listen. Be quiet, girl. When I tell you, this little girl got so much mouth. I do. Oh, well, she's going to learn how to be quiet because I'm going to slap them lips. I mean, I want to Are there any lip-slapping mamas out there? A lot of them. I'm one. But no, it's funny how Hayden's always got something to say. You don't like yeah, What's he doing? Get off of the page. It's not, it's really not that much. Raja. Like, people I don't like. I'm Mimi, okay. Girl, girl. It's over. I, I, I clarified everything on my own, baby. But thank you for being a kind and wonderful help, but I don't need your help. Excuse me, children, in the background. Little girls in the background. Hello? Raja. Bing. Look at Takai trying to hide. Girl, we can see you, little girl. We can see you, Miss Thing, honey, with these little hot shorts on. Anyway, so now that y'all got the scoop, tell your cousin, tell your friend, tell your neighbor, tell, tell your neighbor's sister. Yeah, and all them, Shamika, Ika, and Lika. Or you might want to tell Kwanzaa, Manda, and Fonda. I mean, listen, or Becky, Tramika, and Trine, or hmm, Beverly, Bethann, and. Sherry or Sharon, I don't know. Tell them. Yeah, no. Mama's in teen because I don't want to die from the coronavirus like other people are doing. So I can't go to the gym and I don't want a gym in my house because it would, honey, it would just go to complete waste. Yeah. Uh -uh. So, tell everybody you know. And to all my radio hosts that have my back, that did not ask me but didn't speak on it either because they have no truth with it, thank you so much. All those who put my business out there that thought You're I was welcome. putting business out there, y'all didn't do nothing. You're welcome. Really? Get off me. Everyone that had something to say looked like a bag of lopsided pudding. <laughs> don't, don't they look dumb? They got blue smeared on their face. And they got a, they got right. And whoever stuff. started the story, you're stupid. And God bless you. Their food smells like chili, cheese, and mustard. <laughs> Their fupa smells, smells like, like chili, chili, cheese, and, and mustard. mustard. Ew. <laughs> chili cheese kind of smells good when you eating it. No, chili cheese smells like. It smells like. Nuts. It smells like sweaty. <laughs> oh, baby, that's your son. Uh, is he eating his foot? No. Yeah, anyway, so I ain't got nothing else to say. Y'all heard the tea. Y'all heard it all. When I'm pregnant, I'll let you know. I don't got to let you know. I don't got, I don't, I don't got to tell them nothing, do I? Tell them what I said. Fear the Lord and depart from evil. Boom, just like that. <laughs> now, understand those words. Not pregnant, fear the Lord and depart from evil. Get into that. Oh no! Ooh, my life! My life! My life! My life! My life! My life! Oh yeah! 
Thanks for tuning in to Newborn Arrival.